seven tip. Just gonna skirt right in there. I, I've already drawn the material up. I got a full draw. Let me go ahead and skirt. You don't need to over tighten it. You want to make sure that you get the fastener totally encompassed because it's very easy to uh, miss just a little part and that'll actually make the roof a little bit less. That vulnerable fastener uh, it will make that vulnerable fastener even less uh, watertight. Put just a tiny little pressure against the roof and then I'm picking it straight up. I primarily like these two fastener grade tips. The fastener grade tips are a little longer and they have this flare at the end which fits over top of these fasteners. Now a lot of people think that the different size tips are for the different size fasteners. It's actually not true. It's the different viscosities. So general rule of thumb is if you're working with the product and it feels messy, go to a smaller tip. If it feels like you're having to move too slow, move the bigger tip. Okay, move one in here. So. Zoom in. So you're able to go so fast with the roof tube that you really need to make sure that you get the full thing totally encompassed. Now, if that happens, you can see how, in this case, if this were on this water side, that would be a lot more vulnerable. It's on the side here, so if that happens, no big deal. Just come back, and sometimes you don't even need more product, just so you can reset the tip over it. So I'm just gonna come, and I'm gonna put this right over top, put a little bit of pressure down until I see it coming up, and then I'll pull straight up. 